Hi guys, so over the last couple of days here on this Thanksgiving break, I've had some time to sit down and look at this this Vappy plugin that I found for OBS. Now there were two different versions. There was one made by W23, which is the one that I got to work and that I updated and made a little bit more user friendly. Thank you, big shout out to him by the way. Um, without that code, we I wouldn't have any kind of Vappy set up. Um, but it is working now. So the other one that I tried, it worked with OBS version 19, but I could not get it to work for the life of me. Uh, I may go back with it later on and see if I can get working, but this one that I have is set up. And just to give you guys an idea, I am actually recording with it right now. And I'm gonna bring up the settings. Okay, so what I've done is before it, the device was hard coded, so I updated it to where you could choose whatever uh, Vappy render device you have. I only have one. I don't have. I'm I'm using a Ryzen CPU, so I don't have a, a iGPU to render with. Um, this is just my Vegas 64 that I'm rendering with right now. But if you're on a system that say has an Intel GP or Intel CPU and like an AMD card you could use this to choose between them and it would it would list them as render d128 or ren and render d129 or however many cards you have in the system it'll show renders for um, i still i need to find a way or i would like to find a way to pull the names from the vappy devices so that i could stick them in the description i haven't figured out how to do that yet so uh, if anybody's got any ideas on it or can take a look at the code i would appreciate it uh, but That'll at least let you choose which card you want to use. Um, profile, baseline, and for AMD cards, baseline and main work. I need somebody that has an Intel uh, GPU to test it. I've got it actually listed up here. Things I need tested on Intel. Um, I need B frames tested, and I need the high profile tested. The reason I say that is on AMD, um, B frames do not work. Um, they're not supported and the high profile only records audio for some reason so I'm not sure about that and I'm just using the default high profile from FFmpeg so um, yeah that needs to be solved the um, if you need to see how to change it you in order to use big B frames you have to switch the profile mode to high which then will show you the um, the B frames option here so you, if you're on Intel, if I would appreciate it if you could test that out for me. Um, the other thing is render mode. You can do bitrate or QP. Um, it's one or the other. If you have a bitrate set, the QP um, gets ignored. If you have a if you have the bitrate set to zero, the QP then takes place. Um, I've got it set here to where if you choose QP, it automatically sets the bitrate to zero and then hides the bitrate option and then sets the QP option. Obviously if you go back to bitrate it'll switch it back. So that's what I did with that. Again you have to be on the high profile in order to use that so if you can get to test in that it would be awesome but um, for now those are the options that I've got set up. Hopefully it helps. Um, I really really could use some extra input on this on Intel side because like I said I don't have a system to test it with at the moment. Um, but yeah, as long as it works. If it works, that's great. Thanks, guys. See ya.